Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome back to Big Money Fishing. We're out here at the, go at the coast again. Out here in Corpus Christi right now. We're right here, right off the JFK. Right here by the Causeway Bait and Shop and Red Dot Pier. So, man, check it out. It's all foggy, all... It's cold today. It's like 50-something degrees right now. When I started driving out this way, I've been driving since like 5.30, 5.40 in the morning. And man, it was like 40-something degrees. I just got here from San Antonio. So, let's, let's get set up. We're gonna just fish for whatever we can get today. Some reds, some trout, flounder, whatever we can hook up. Um, no targeted species today, just whatever. Uh, so we'll fish this area for a while. This is gonna be a three-day kind of video. So it's gonna be a three-part video, hopefully. Um, I'll be camping out inside my truck. I got all the stuff in there. I got a mattress and all that stuff. So let's get ready and let's get out there and fish. See you here in a bit. I think I put it on there backwards, but we'll see how this works. And if we gotta change it up, we'll change it up. My hands are shivering already. You got a little wet. Now the cold. Looks pretty good in the water. So, all right, guys. So we're here at the jetties. Nothing was going on at the flats or where I was weight fishing. Uh, but I came out here to the jetties and see what we could hook up into. And maybe I'll throw the spoon for some Spanish here in a little bit. But. We'll see what we could get into this weather. It's really not optimal today. It's real cold, windy. So let's just try our best and let's get out there. Ice man grew. Um, this is the first one I caught. All right, first one on the board today, guys. That's what I'm talking about. This guy's going home. This guy's going home. Check him out. Check him out. There he is. Let's check out those teeth. Hey, he's a good size one too. He kept coming back for the kept coming back and back for it. Put your spikes down. There we go. He's, he's a big one. Let's 
Let's try to get some more. Let's try to get some more. That's what I'm talking about. Man, I wasn't. I didn't have my bag on that big because I wasn't expecting a snapper that big. They like to hang out by the rocks. Uh, oh yeah, I got a spoon too. Look at that, man. <laughs> <laughs> Put all these shrimp to use today. Yeah. No. I keep giving back, keep putting them back into the ocean. I keep dropping them. Slippy little burgers today. There goes my shrimp just out there jumping around for his dear life. Yeah. But I just got it. Ah, this is my second one. Oh, yeah. I got it. Yeah, I got a bigger one in here. A bigger one? Yeah. We fish with shrimp? Yeah, just shrimp. That's a nice one. Yeah. You got a bigger one in yeah. here too? Yeah. You want to check them out real quick? Oh, wow. Yeah. yeah he bigger. Those are as good eating as you get. Yeah, that's what I heard. I never tried them. So, oh. I'm going to try them out now. Too much. It's so really delicate. Just a little saute on them. Just a light saute and boom. Right, I right, appreciate that tip. Yeah, appreciate that tip. There we go again, guys. There we go again. We got another one right here. Got another one. Let's measure him out. Uh, he's a little too small for my liking, so we'll throw him back. Mangrove snappers are species for the day. Chill, chill. There we go. Check them out. Yeah, I'm not going to keep anything under 12. Hi. Not enough meat on him to be keeping. So. Get another one, let's get another one. Let's use this big old bubble right here. He about to die anyway. Let's see if he brings us a big old snapper. Alright guys, we're in a row on the snapper, so hopefully we hook up some more. We're able to take a few home and do a cook on them. Alright, let's see if we hook up on this big old shrimp that I just put on there. Yeah, too much. I get them too much. Too much drag. These guys are pretty strong, so I guess you give them an inch to take a whole mile. So that was my bad. That was my bad. Oh, the little guy just jumped out. There we go, there we go. Man. There we go guys, there we go. We're on the mangrove. Matt is getting ready to spike me. Put those little 
sharp teeth. He's only eight inches. There we go. We'll let him go. Let him live another day. Man, these little mangroves fight pretty good. Like, they're small, man. I feel like if I'm fighting big old sheep head or something. Oh, oh, oh. There he goes. I've been losing them all day like that, guys. I've been losing them like that all day. What you get, you give back and they give back. There you go. I've got this Spanish here, guys. Silver? Yeah. Spanish macro? Yeah. Chill out, guys. All right. Check them out. Yeah, let's go measure them up real quick. Yeah. Let me measure them up real quick, man. Yeah. Let me make sure that he's a keeper. Yeah, 15. Huh? With a spoon? Yeah. Nah, he's 14. He's gonna have to go back. Yeah, he was feeding. Look at the, he's yeah. spitting out shrimp or something. <laughs> yeah. So, so yeah. Spoon. Um, could go check it out. It's right there. It's on my line. Okay. Check him out, guys. He's there spitting out food and stuff. And he's eating. He's on lunch. He's got good hood pretty good but it's one inch under Ugh. Let's see if we could get another one. oh look he swam away he's gone yeah there you went he swam away let's 
try to get another one, guys. All right, guys. I got three in, three in the bucket. Three mangrove snappers in the bucket. Let's see if I could get a couple more. My kids wanted to eat some fish when I get back home, so I'm trying to catch a few more. Um, it's been kind of tough. Tough day of fishing. Water's rough. Weather's rough. Everything's just rough today. Croaker. <laughs> this is not a red. <laughs> Guys, I think it's a croaker because I could hear it croaking. It's a big old one though too. So check it out. I might keep them because I heard that they've been good eating. Or is it the whiting? Oh fish. Chill, chill. You're a croaker because you're just croaking. You're just croaking. There we go, guys. Big old croaker. I'm going to use him up for cup bait tonight. <laughs> He's going to be bait for tonight so we can soak up some bait. Um, I might go spend the night at the Packery Channel and just let him soak in there. See what's up with that. Let me just get my wa hands washed and we will get some more. Another mangrove snapper, all right. There we go, there we go. You guys, nice size one. He's a nice one. We're gonna keep him. He has some nice fillets on him for a couple tacos. There we go. Thanks for playing, buddy. Ah. Stop, stop. Stop acting all crazy. Hookup ratio is better by the tail, I'll tell you that much. I've been hooking up more now than what I, than what I was earlier. Hey, what's up, guys? All right, so y'all saw what I caught. I caught a few, um, well, to start off with, I'm pretty much done with today. It was cold windy wet rainy everything it was just like not a great day for fishing i'm already laying down but this is gonna be my bedroom for the night i'm sleeping in my truck so hopefully it's all well check it out air up mattress that i got for my truck it fits in the back seat it has like a little piddle built into it too. So you can lay back and just chill. Boom. So I'm basically still fishing, but I got I got a rod up there somewhere. I don't know if y'all can see. But, yeah. but man, I don't know if I'm gonna fish for the next few days either. I was planning to stay for like two, three days, but with the way the weather is, it's just it's just crazy. Um, I don't want to get sick, especially in these times that we have right now. So we'll see what happens. But thanks for watching. 
And thanks for watching. Make sure you just subscribe. Hit that bell notification so y'all can know every time I drop a new video. Mm. And all that good stuff. And let's see what we come up with. Thanks. Thanks once again. Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome back to Big Buddy Fishing. Here we are, day two. Um, I'm still out here. I'm just waking up. Um, yeah, it's kind of late. Man, I slept pretty good on this little area of batteries that they sell for you, like the pickup trucks. I got it on Amazon. I forgot what it's called, but um, it's pretty awesome. It's already like 6 o'clock in the morning and 6.25 and normally when I sleep in my truck I'm up by like 5 in the morning, 4 in the morning because it's just an unpleasant way to sleep in the vehicle but anyways, uh, it's raining outside, it's 45 degrees, it's windy, super windy. I don't even think I want to get out of my truck right now. <laughs> I got my truck running so I could. It got cold last night, so I just turned it on right now so I could warm up a little bit. But let's see if this wind and this rain dies down a little bit and we could get out there and do a little fishing today before we head back home. So let's see what happens.